Hi guys, it's Nathan from It's Simply Tech, and I'm going to be showing you how to make trailers in iLife 11's iMovie. Okay, so when you've loaded up iMovie, which I assume you all have, you will get this lovely window. So make sure you've firstly imported some clips in, which is pretty straightforward. All you have to do is file, and then import from camera or import, and then you can select where the files are on your computer. Now you're going to want to make a new project, so File, New Project. Now you get all these lovely project themes, and then down here we get Movie Trailers. So choose one which you think suits the film you're making. I'm going to choose Blockbuster, as I've used this one before and I know how to do it. So, we get a little um, example here, which we'll play in a second. I do hope. So, yep, that's your little preview and it will start making the project for you. Here we go, it's loaded. Now, we've got a lot of things to do. Okay, so we need to say our movie name, so let's call it, uh, what should we call it? The film. Uh, it's gonna come out December 25th, 2010. So there we go, we got that all sorted. Now we need the cast names, cast number one, We'll leave it as mom, dad, Vanessa and Karen. Karen's a male, I'll say. Change it to Jake. There you go, Jake. Okay, so now we've got even more studio name, I Nathan M Films. And you can choose like the introduction thing, so we can like have Snowy Mountain Peak. Which we'll get a little preview I think of. So that they're the kind of things that come up before the movie. And we've got all our fake people, I'm gonna leave that as it is. You can choose who the writ is written by, edited by, directed by, the executive producer, and so on. And that will come up as a little credit thing at the end. Now, if you click on shot list, you'll get all the shots in order. So all the action shots, all the group shots. If you're on storyboard, you'll be putting them in the order that the film is. Now, I prefer to use the um, storyboard layout. So, let's do it. So simply click on the one you want. And we will select 3.4 seconds. So just drag to 3.4 seconds. And let go. Don't worry about that, that will only happen from there because the camera I used is 25 frames per second. Right, so in the landscape again. So we'll use this one and drag it out. That's 2.7. So you, you kind of need to be exact. Some of them it doesn't matter how many you put in. Uh, this one in particular, the 5.8 second one, you need 5.8 seconds for some reason, which I do not know why. So, what you're going to do is we'll go from here 5.8 seconds there we go full of adventure okay so action shot so from here we just pretty much drag and drop shots now no 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 you can filter by keywords and I believe if you click on action no it doesn't want to okay there is a way to filter it between um, through all the different you know features now let's go rid of that I have to come back with you on that one guys, but it is there, I know it is, I've seen it, I've seen it. But anyway, let's do some action shots. So we're going to have one of someone running, okay, here we go. That's 2.2 seconds we want. 2.2. There we go, so you know, you're just dragging and dropping. Group, now for group you need more than one person. The clip I got kind of failed, but it works. So 2.0, there we go. Now you've got to do a medium shot. So medium would be kind of, where are we? Here's a medium shot. So you want two seconds of that. So you just got a few of these to fit in. And then you've got a trailer. So, pretty much guys, that's all you're going to have to do now. Let's see what it looks like when you've finished it.
So guys, that was what I did earlier, and it is really that simple. All you have to do is drag and drop and place it where you want it. Um, I'll show you this one that we did. Let you just give me a drag and you get this nice trailer. So yeah, that's as simple as it is to make a trailer, guys. I'll be doing more iLife 11 videos. Me and Amy will probably be doing a few more. So do keep checking out the channel. Make sure to hit the awesome subscribe button and keep checking our videos out because we will do some more. Um, anything you want us to look over on iLife 11, please do leave a comment down below and I will get back to you in the comments as quick as possible. Thanks for watching, guys. It's me, Nathan, from It's Simply Tech.